G'day! Moz's Morning Tea Moto Vlogs are back for 2023. Heading out early, early ride to uh, to do a motor, morning tea moto vlog. And while we're at it, does anyone remember this? Well, the Arnie Jack Show. It was produced by the ABC uh, and was a uh, local Logie Award winning Australian TV comedy series. It ran from 1972 to 1973 and attained cult status, and it still is. There are two series with a total of 13 episodes, followed by two specials. One was in 1973, just before Series 2 came in, and the other was in October 1975. Wow, it's breezy here today. Anyway, it was first created as a proposed ABC children radio series intending to replace uh, the Argonauts Club that was about to be cancelled. However, it didn't go to air, as the character and some of the songs were considered inappropriate for young listeners. There had never been anything like Arnie Jack. Um, Graham Bond's outrageous character, the bikey and self-proclaimed queen of Wollongong, was the complete opposite of television presenting. and. Uh, I was born in Wollongong. Um, I spent most of my child, childhood years there, on and off, but all of my teenage years there. A moustached hostess who threatened to jump out of the viewers' television sets and rip their bloody arms off. Arnie Jack and her cast of characters, Thin Arthur, played by Rory O'Donoghue, Kid Eager, played by Gary McDonald, and you'd know Gary McDonald from the Norm Gunston days, if you're old enough, and Flange Desire, played by Sandra McGregor. They brought a new sense of humour to our TV screens. Irreverent, bizarre, full of original music, and most importantly, uniquely Australian. At 11.57pm on the 28th of February 1975, Arnie Jack, Thin Arthur and Kid Eager introduced Colour TV to Australia on the a ABC TV network, beating all other TV stations by three minutes because ABC snuck it in a little bit earlier. This portion I'm about to show you shows how how they introduced it. The colour! It's leaking through the window! Turn a filthy thing all over my new carpet! Ah, look, it's filling the room! How are we gonna breathe? Quicker. In 1974, Arnie Jack's Wollongong the Brave was filmed being a collection of four comedy specials derived from Arnie Jack's show. The fourth and final episode was a precursor to the Norm Gunston show. Uh, the episodes were aired during 1975. The music film clip uh, for Wollongong the Brave features a huge golden glove perched atop Mount Kira, as seen here. I remember it, not that I saw it, 
but it was on the new local news that night. So, if you're old enough, do you remember the Arnie Jack show? The things you've got to do to get a cuppa here. Me and my Wog Espresso machine. I'm allowed to say that because I'm a Wog. bit of doing in this wind. Cheers. Oh, awesome. And an awesome view to boot. What an awesome view from up here. This is the Miller Miller Lookout. Been up here before for morning teas. Bloody windy today, though. See that there? That there? That's Mount Bartle Freya, highest mountain in Queensland. Jack, cause we know you'll be back. Though you're ten feet tall, you don't scare us at all. You're big, bold and tough, but you're not so rough. The scream as you plummet away. Goodbye, my little lovelies. Now you better listen close. You better watch Moz's video right to the end Cause if you don't I'll jump through your computer And rip your bloody arms off I will